So today I'm here to um, talk about how to manage having many tabs open like I have here. If that is your problem, then you're in the right place. Let's get right to it. So you open a new tab, then you just type in Chrome Store. I already have that typed in. So when you get to Chrome Store, you search for one tab. Type in the search button. So install the one that has this thumbnail. You'll see add to Chrome here. I have rated here because I've already installed it. After you've installed it, it will show up as an icon in the top right corner. When I point at it, you see the name there, one tab. Now, what one tab does is that when you click on the icon here, it groups your tabs onto one page. So let me show you. Look at this mess and see the magic that happens. When I click on it, there you have it. The nice thing about this is I can close Chrome and reopen Chrome at any time and it will always return to this page, this one tab page. If I want to read just this article today, I just click on this and it opens in a new tab. If I want to restore all my, my, my saved tabs on this page, I can click on restore all and it will open in a new browser. And there you have it. Such a beautiful um, tab and it's, it makes handling multiple tabs a very easy task. I can always group them back again to my one tab page. If I have one tab open here and I have extra tabs because I'm reading this page and I open more, more, more links. For example, I open this and that. I can still group them by clicking on the button and it groups in a new session. So you see that the new tabs I opened are now grouped in a new session and the old tabs are grouped in a previous section. I have many more open down there. If I were to scroll down to the bottom, you see that I use this tab, this, this Chrome extension extensively. Now to manage the tabs, you can move some across to group them. It just, it saves the group based on the date you clicked on it or the time you clicked on it or the session you clicked. So you can always move things around if you don't really care about when it was opened. You can delete um, the tab, the open tabs, but I don't really want to do that now. You can share this page as a web page so that someone else would open and have all the tabs. So you can imagine the, the advantages that can bring. For example, you have some tabs open and you want to send it to a friend to read what you're reading. You can, you can say, share it as a web page. So usually for me, this is enough and I have many tabs open just click on the button it saves it onto this page for me and I can always come back to it um, but you can do a lot more with your stored um, tabs so when you come to more you can name a tab group so if I were to name this as um, modeling articles group it would save it as that you can lock a tab when you lock the tab or the tab group you can't delete it. So you see here, I can delete all these tabs, but I can't delete this because I've locked it. Let me unlock it. You can also star a tab group. When you star it, it pins it to the top. You can star the rest. And normally what would you do with the star? You're just trying to move things to the top. And one tab tends to group the star tabs in order of when you, you start them. You can unstar um, your, your tab groups and you can also go to the help file for more information. When you come to um, this side of the one tab page, you can go to options and you can play with the options here. There are a lot more you can, but I'm pretty sure this is a very one of the, my top 10 Chrome extensions. Um, for having a nice experience when I'm using Chrome. If you liked this video, please don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment. You can ask me to cover a topic you want and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching this video. See you next time. 
Bye.